I'm Sir Tap Tap, and let's play Neo Aquarium, the King of Crustaceans. This is a really weird crab battle game. That's um, one of many games localized by uh, or published by Playism. So it's basically like a kaiju combat game, except you are a small crustacean, but you shoot lasers. Um, I already played as corn barnacles, you can see, and that was pretty amazing. We're gonna play. We're gonna be Mr. Krabs over here. Uh, you can customize your aquarium, but I didn't really bother with that. I'm kind of scared, but we'll go on normal. It's a one-on-one -on -one fighting sort of game. Um, you can read the insane story here. The budget's obviously very low, but it's just the kind of dumb fun that I think is pretty neat. So let me explain what happened when I did my barnacle run. So basically when you're a barnacle, you can spawn extra barnacles. You like play as the little creature that's like, you know, that spawns, I guess, a bunch of other barnacles and like each barnacle can shoot lasers or homing missiles and you can charge up for like more powerful lasers. It's like a, basically like a living swarm of missile silos and it's pretty amazing. So the story, I, I mean, you can see the story. It's crazy, and there's a bunch of, there's just basically a bunch of crustaceans that shoot lasers, and they're gonna fight each other. That's what's important here. They're going to pwn the battlefield like hacksaws. And humanity is being a bunch of dick bags like usual. Thus begins the Neo Aquarium battles. We hope you enjoyed your lesson. me. Alright, let's speed that up a bit. So, you don't really need to read the story, but there's some fun jokes in there. I'll leave that up for a second. I, I'm not entirely sure. What the, I think the customizer for the aquarium, not the, like, fighter. Of course, all the, these are, like, attributed, like, quotes. They're obviously made up. Alright, so we're Mr. Krabs. I don't know how to play Mr. Krabs, so that might be a slight complication. Yeah, basically you can shoot lasers by pressing square, homing missiles by holding it, and you got this power and skill thing? I'm not sure what... what is... Oh, I'm doing my melee attack. Um, hang on, where did, did he burrow? Yeah. We're gonna charge up our skill. Oh, that's what our skill does. It's just like really strong lasers with the barnacle. Oh, he did it too? And you can sort of climb up and... Weird. As a barnacle, it extends your power meter, but I guess it doesn't when you're a crab. Because when you're a barnacle, the only way to ascend is to shed your barnacle. Oh, did, the, did I just fall under the ground? I think I'm... Oh. He's almost down! I'm not entirely sure why, but sometimes hits that land don't seem to do damage. I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. Oh, how everything works, to be quite honest. Hooray! Over organic. I have no idea what some of these things mean. And the game starts off in 4-3, but you can set it to 16-9. Obviously, as I'm playing in 16-9. Um, you, oh, right. You can turn off this display. Um, I had it turned off before. I'm not, ooh. Oh, right. You can shed your shell. Um, how do I, can I interact with you? No, don't shed your shell again. Maybe I should leave that help on. All right, you can hold R1 to use different like skills, and the breakaway ra attacks are like, like you sh shed parts of your body to attack with them. It's pretty great. I am not entirely sure how all of them work though. Like I have no idea how this crab specials actually work, honestly. Like, I don't know how to use my bits here. Oh. Oh crap, I shed my shell. Shedding your shell drops your skill meter down to zero. 
which is unfortunate because shell meter or skill meter is like you can do a crazy amount of damage with your skills. Like your regular stuff is pretty tame in comparison. I want to know how to pick stuff up. No, it's not B. Stop pressing B. Why are you doing that? Okay. Maybe I can't pick things up. Maybe I'm just dumb. I don't know. Right, we're just gonna calm down. Hide that display. And, uh, get some skill power built up. The AI isn't too amazing. We broke his shell! Oh, this is just that underwater thing. Mantis shrimps. Whatever they're called. Maybe that's just a normal shrimp, actually. There we go. I don't like this guy's skills. I don't... I'm sorry, Mr. Krabs. I'm just... I'm not very impressed. Do I get... No. And you unlock crap for your aquarium. I haven't bothered too much with customizing the aquarium. I'm not sure if it, like... I really have no idea if you can, like, actually interact with these things, or just... I guess I can't destroy them. Maybe they're just like automated defenses? I'm frankly not entirely sure how this game works, but it just seemed like stupid enough fun that I could show off a few rounds here. Because I mean, you are a crab, or general crustacean. Oh, it's the- excellent! Barnacles. Barnacles are terrifying. Let's do some breakaway attacks. I'm not sure how those even work, honestly. Okay, we can't really see it at this range, but the actual barnacle is this little fish thing there that jumps around. Alright. Suffer! The barnacle cannot go very high. Dang, that really hurts when it actually hits. Also, those laser things that are reaching out are the barnacle's special attack. It's really great. I guess this burrowing is actually pretty effective because it can't seem to hit underground. You feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? Absolutely crabulous. I kind of wish we could change animals between things. Oh, see, its defenses are moving! I think those are defenses then, those little things that you can place. But you can place, like, different animals and stuff in your aquarium. I didn't realize what they were for, but I guess they, you know, can attack and stuff. Can I just... There we go. It takes a little bit for the homing shots to kick in. Giant isopods? I wish I could be a giant isopod. Those are great. Maybe they're not crustaceans, so I can't play as them. Apparently barnacles are crustaceans. I thought barnacles were included just as a joke or something. But A, they are actually quite effective, and B, they apparently are actually crustaceans. So we're just going to turn up our skill. Come on, hit him! Oh yeah, this crab seems really cool. It has, like, laser sword claws. I've never played as the Mr. Krabs Crab before, so... I'm a little underwhelmed with his skills, but... He seems pretty dangerous when he's underground, somehow. Like, things can't hit him, I guess, which is neat. The plain lasers don't... aren't very accurate, but with the, with the barnacle, they can be pretty dang good, because you just shoot a crap ton of them. And you can aim from different angles, because of the multiple different barnacles. Why am I so ineffective in this fight? I don't get why I'm not hurting. Should have picked a different crab, honestly. Let's try some breakaway attacks. I have no idea what they do, but we'll, 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 we'll try. Also, breaking your legs off and stuff does actually slow you down. Kind of unsurprisingly. But you just shed your shell to 
Oh, right, this is the one that uses his own shedded shell as a shield, which is pretty amazing. Right, I have no idea what to do against this guy. We're just gonna collect... Parker. Parker. I can't see him. Um... We're just gonna spam skills at him, because I don't know what else to do, honestly. Man, we're gonna shed our shell. Ow. Move. There must be some action button that I can press to, like, pick up things. I don't know what it is. Ah! I shed, I shed my shell again. Oh yeah, and killing the little dudes gives you DNA, which gives you more skill and stuff, I think. Camera. Camera, please. Camera. Oh, level three skill, go! Oh, shh! I was at level three! Oh. The laser crab is dangerous. Can I, like, change my character with customize, or I have no idea what- oh. No, I don't want to edit. Aw. Oh well. We'll do one battle showing you Laser Crab. Which one was Laser Crab? Not that one. I think it was Snow Crab. Sure. Wait, not the same. I think this guy was like the final boss or something. Like he was he was locked at least. He's not like crazy overpowered. Oh god. We walk like a crab. Excellent. How do I do those sweet lasers? Sweet lasers? Yes! How do I use them, though? Hmm. It's pretty relentless. Let my people go! Laser crab! I don't know how to use my la my crab lasers, actually. Let's try level 2 crab lasers. We almost got level 2. There we go. Level 2! Oh, I just fire off all of my limbs so they shoot lasers. They don't seem to aim, though. With the... With the barnacles, they auto-aim when you do the, a laser attack, which is very useful. Oh well. We're to die to Squidzilla or whatever his name is here. I'm not good at this game, but I thought it was ridiculous enough that I should show it off. It seems... To, it, it wins by ridiculous quotient alone. See, they just sort of aim randomly, it seems like, but the, uh, with the barnacles, all of the barnacles would, like, lift up and aim directly at the target. It was really amazing. I should have been barnacle. Barnacle's great, but I wanted to show off something other than barnacle. Oh, well. We didn't get to see barnacle very well in the barnacle fight, so... No, not as this one. So let me show you a proper barnacle fight. No? Ah. Sorry. Terrible with menus, apparently. The amazing corn barnacle. Let's not fight against, fin fight against final boss. Let's. I'm not sure if we've seen the lobster yet. Or not. Yeah, the lobster. Let's go. I'm not sure why there's a practice run for. Uh, for you mode. But yeah, you just hop around and spawn some barnacles here. You can have a maximum of 10 barnacles. Also, spawning barnacles will reduce your skill gauge, so you don't want to just constantly do it. Which also means you can't... You jerk! I think he killed my barnacles. This is our level one. Aw. He ended it, like, instantly, as he got hit. It, like, shoots out wave lasers. Oh wow, you can attach them to walls. That's pretty great. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Taking damage seems to increase your meter too. 
But yeah, the barnacles can shoot lasers. Pretty amazing. Why? Run! Run! Ah. Yeah, the major flaw of the barnacle is very low mobility. And it also seems- it also reduces your skill meter. You can- the, For some reason, ascend- you can ascend by dropping multiple barnacles, but that means your barnacles all cluster up and it burns out your uh, skill meter real quick. But yeah, in exchange for the immobility, barnacle can deal a crazy amount of damage with skills. Oh god, get out of the legs! Get out of the legs! No! I want to do a level 3, but whatever. I don't have time for that crap. Alright, can we win? And there's a decent amount of homing with the uh, barnacle skills, which is why I like it. And you can just sort of surround an enemy with fire. If you... Why is all the DNA going to him? He has some to me. Oh well. Level 2, go! Kill it! No! Aw, oh, that was so close. Yeah, now you see the majesty that is the barnacle. And that is Neo Aquarium, the King of Crustaceans. It is very stupid in a very good way.